Hello YouTube, I'm back again, and um, I've got another package here, and um, to tell you the truth, I just recorded a video of a big package from a buddy of mine from uh, Houston, Texas, uh, Kevin, and um, again, I'm going to not say his last name for his own privacy, but Kevin had sent out a giant package I just have recorded. It's going to be going up soon, and everybody will get to see it and know what I'm talking about, and so when you watch this video... If you haven't watched the other, go back and watch it. There's some awesome glasses from Papa John's. A lot of Red Sox stuff. He sent some cool vintage football from like 60, the 68, 69 seasons. Uh, a lot of cool stuff from my nephew. He even threw in some stuff from me. And um, right after I'm re recording the video and everything, trying to get caught up on that one and um, and get and get it uploaded. And I already had a couple other videos that I had not never got around to uploading that I recorded like a, you know like about two weeks ago almost. And I'm just getting, you know, I, like I said, I, I wasn't feeling good for a few days, several days uh, last week. And I was busy, too, and trying to work online when I could. And I just got behind on, on getting, staying caught up on stuff. And I hadn't seen my nephew yet, so I just recorded that video uh, to this, you know, like, you know, earlier. And, and then I go to the mailbox, and boom, there's another package from my buddy Kevin from Houston, Texas. Here you go. And so I'm going to go ahead now and sit right back down here on the porch, do another video, and show you another package that my buddy Kevin sent out. And I did go through these real quick, look through them really quick. And um, there were there were tons of packs of cards here, but I went through, put a ton of these in plastic sleeves, you know. And um, I didn't think I had any more plastic sleeves, to tell you the truth about it. And I happened to remember I'd ordered some off of... Um, Amazon and because um, I found some cheaper than I can usually buy them for and um, I had stuck that I thought I'd used them all but I'd stuck a couple of hundred count packs in a in a box and I happened to see them and so I grabbed them up and I put a bunch of these cards on in plastic sleeves for my nephew now I'm out of top loads but Kevin had, had sent out a ton more uh, Red Sox for my nephew and so I'm going to go through some of these here and share them with you this won't be quite as long as the last video because there's not quite as much here, but some very nice cards. This and this one right here said Castilla Rookies, and it's runs the Castilla, who has actually fell on hard times, never lived up to the awesome potential forecast for him since Boston signed him. But all of these are di are different runs the Castilla Rookies, and so Castilla is still a very talented guy. Uh, he actually has been took off Boston's 40-man roster now. And uh, they had talked like that he would be in AAA and probably wouldn't get called up unless there was injuries, which happens all the time in baseball. But um, still, you never know. And he could move on to another team. And, you know, he was coming from Cuba. Uh, he had been a star in Cuba. And he's had some injury problems that has hindered him since he came to Boston. But uh, you never know. He could, he could still pan out and turn into a star before it's over with. He's still not that old. Um, these are all cards that I put in plastic sleeves, and I'm going to go through some of these because these are nice cards. Yes, Carl Yastrzemski, Hall of Famer. Beautiful, beautiful card. Very thick, thick border card here, and this is from 2012. I, I, I love that card myself. My nephew's going to love that. I need a top load for that one. Uh, here's a Jackie Bradley Jr., and you can see here, it's got the uh, hole of full look to it. Not your standard base one there. That's a nice one. Um, and right here we got classic walk-offs. David Ortiz. Very nice card. Uh, here we got uh, Hanley Ramirez rated rookie. Very beautiful card. Uh, Mar Marico Dubon, I think is how you say this guy's name. With Boston uh, prospect there. Dustin Pedroa, my nephew's favorite. Mookie Betts. Love the name. Star prospect Michael Kopeck now with the White Sox organization traded in the Chris Sale deal. This guy was just clocked this spring at 105 mile an hour in a in a spring training game. That's pretty darn hard. <laughs> Bryce Brent's rookie card, Boston. That's the uh, you know, like uh, made to look like the '83 tops set. Uh, here's Bogarts, star shortstop for the Red Sox. Here's another Mookie Betts. Here's a Yaz. Nice Yaz card there from Allen and Ginner. Another Henry Owens rookie card and another Henry Owens rated rookie. It's not the same one. There's two in there. 
Here's a Alan and Gunner Wade Boggs nice portrait card. Uh, Carlton Fisk Hall of Famer. Uh, here's another Dustin Pedroa nice card there. Uh, Jim Rice uh, Hall of Famer, another Hall of Famer, former Boston great. Here's another Hall of Famer, former Boston great, Jimmy Fox. Now it is from the old days, you know, old school, old school Red Sox. Here's another nice, um, made to look like the '84 top set, uh, Jim Rice, Boston great. Another Jim Rice there, from Allen and Ginner. Another Jim Rice from another Allen and Ginner set, Carlton Fisk baseball heroes. Here is Jackie Bradley Jr. My nephew really likes him too. He loves all the young, you know, he loves all the current Red Sox for sure. Uh, David Ortiz, who he was really saddened, retired, but there's uh, league leaders and Ortiz is on that card. Here's another nice David Ortiz right there. Very beautiful Jacoby Ellsbury. My nephew is not, he was getting into the Red Sox about the time that um, Ellsbury was finishing up his Red Sox days, but um, he, he does know who he is. John, same thing with this guy, Jonathan Papelbaum. He doesn't really remember how great those guys were for Boston at one time. Right here is uh, the same card. One is from the standard um, Bowman set. One is from Bowman Chrome, Michael Kopech. Prospect I was talking about just recently. was clocked at 105 mile an hour in spring training. And a Topps Gold from 2012, Daniel Bard. That's a beautiful card. The gold cards, even, you know, that's a common player. But I'm going to tell you something. If you try to put together a set of any of the top sets of recently with the, of the gold version good luck finding every single card in gold because it, it, they're, they're not that easy to find um and because of that even the common players you know there's a lot more value to uh the gold version the gold versions so some very beautiful cards and my buddy kevin has really outdone himself and i want to put a plug in here while i'm doing this second video i didn't think about it in the first because it was such a long video i was doing earlier and I was really surprised to get another package from Kevin so quick right behind that first one. It was in the mailbox right after, I'm, you know, I'm just going through the first package. I get done, I go to the mailbox, and there's another package. Kevin also sent some cards here that are not um, a couple that are not um, actually Red Sox. Here's a Frank Thomas rookie card. from This is from 1990 Tops, and my nephew knows very well who Frank Thomas is. Hall of Famer now, 500 home runs in his career, and he has been wanting a Thomason to... I bought a box of uh, 1990 score to try to help him uh, get a chance to pull a um, 19, uh, it was a draft pick, a score rookie card of Thomas. And amazingly enough, out of 36 packs, we didn't get one. But um, but now he's got the 1990 draft pick, top draft pick version of Frank Thomas rookie card. Right here is a gold version, uh, top 60 year anniversary uh, home run derby, David Ortiz. Those are very rare. Gold version. Nice, nice card of Ortiz there. And right here is um, a Craig Vigio rookie card. He's another Hall of Famer. This guy, I loved him. Watching him play. Gritty, hustling player. This is from 89 score. And uh, Vigio, awesome guy. I need to top load for that card. And right here, there's so much here. I'm not going to go through all these. But right here is a bunch more. All red stocks. Raphael Devers, um, several of him, Brian Johnson. These are rookie cards, by the way. Blake Sweetheart, Bryce Brin, um, and some prospects I've never, never even heard of. Several Matt Barnes rookies. Right there on the back is a Hanley Ramirez, who is not a rookie, but still one of Boston's big, uh, big, big name hitters. Ramirez, man, I remember when he came up with Florida. Uh, he was actually originally a Red Sox prospect. And they traded him. They gave up on him. And then he turned into a star with Florida. And he's made his way back to Boston over the years. And right here is um, this package. I've got all these in sleeves here. Mookie Betts. Three different Mookie Betts right there. Um, here is uh, three back-to-back -back David Prices. My nephew loves David Price. He was thrilled when Boston got him. Um, picked him up. There's a nice Price. Here's a couple of Porcellos, Rick Porcello. Here's another Rick Porcello. Um, here's a few more Mookie Betts, car, nice cards here of Betts. And um, my nephew doesn't talk about Betts or Jackie Bradley Jr. as much as he loves Pedroa and uh, Ben Intendi, but these guys are some of the you know, best young players in baseball. And Boston has got, they built a great team through the minor their minor league system. 
And they're going to be good for a long time if they can keep it together, you know. Salaries and free agency. That's David Ortiz, by the way. Here's a couple of uh, Mookie Betts again. And um, all these beautiful, beautiful cards. Beautiful cards. Here's something my nephew's going to love, and there's a couple of these in here. Let me see if I can find them both at the same time. Red Sox mascot cards. Right there. Two of them. Red Sox mascot cards. Kevin, thank you for sending those. That, that That's the kind of thing. You know, a kid my, my nephew's age just going to be thrilled with them. Here's a nice David Ortiz. Like the 1980 Tops version of that set. Another nice, beautiful David Ortiz. And here's three more. David Ortiz is right there. Very nice. Beautiful cards. Kevin, I don't know where you get all these, buddy. But thank you so much for sending these out to my nephew. He is going to, I mean, he ain't going to know what to think. Because um, this is like as much as I usually get him together in a month. Just what I've had in that first package I've done a video of earlier today. And then going and getting this out of the mailbox. And right here is another whole stack of all Red Sox. To save time, since I'm already over the 10 minute mark again, I won't go through all of these. But, um, and that is, let me see if I can go through some of the highlights. This is the last pack. Um, I mean, you can see these are, there's a prism card of uh, Victorino, who is no longer with uh, Allen and Gunnar Sandoval. Just a whole slew of Red Sox. There's their prospect, Raphael Devers, a uh, top prospect of theirs. Here's uh, uh, Alfredo Aceves. I can't even remember. I barely remember him, but he, he did pitch for Boston for a while. Former uh, hyped prospect, Lars Anderson, who never really turned into nothing, but when he was first signed by Boston, as a pro, you know, he was supposed to be the next uh, big thing, you know, in a minor league system. Boston... It's kind of like a bonus baby. Boston gave him a big bunch of money to keep him from going to college and sign with him out of high school, I believe. But he's never amounted to anything. At any rate, um, these are just some awesome, awesome cards. And uh, my nephew is going to love all of these. Like I said, I run out of... I, I did find a few plastic sleeves. Got several of these star cards and some sleeves. But but I ran out and uh, I'm out of top. I was going to have to pick up some more. But Kevin, thank you so much, buddy. These last two videos... That I've done. They're all about stuff my buddy Kevin from Houston, Texas went out. And I, and I want to say this. I forgot to say it earlier. If anybody out there that's been sending me stuff or watches my videos, if you've got cards of Josh Willingham. Josh Willingham. The Hammer. Josh Willingham. He's played for a lot, a lot of teams in his career. If you got any, he's a common player in a lot of common players' boxes. But if you got any, ship them to me. Uh, send them to me or message me on YouTube. If you if if you don't you know if you've got some you don't mind getting rid of, my buddy Kevin uh, collects Willingham cards uh, for a friend of his. So if you've got any, send them to me, and and I, I can move them on to Kevin to help somebody else out. Cause that's what my buddy Kevin likes to do. He likes to try to help people um, with um, what they collect and their favorite players. Also, Kevin, I'm going to have some cards going out to you here. Uh, I'm going to try to get them shipped out to you in the next few days. Some Houston teams. Um, Texans, Astros, uh, Houston Rockets, just whatever I can put together. And also, buddy out there, Mason Peterson. And for those of you that don't know, look him up on YouTube, Mason Peterson 21. Check out his channel. And uh, Mason, I'm going to be sending you out some Cubby cards, buddy. Uh, thank you all for watching. Be back again with you soon in the near future.